So I'm taking a bit of a risk by uh, standing this in the middle of the barrel because um, I have now broken two of these quite expensive bus meters. And if it falls over, it should just avoid clipping the edge of the barrel, but that's how it was the last one. So in goes the liquid and up floats the must meter. So it's measuring the specific gravity, the density of the liquid. The more sugar is in there, the more dense it is. And the more alcohol, the less dense. So as the fermentation goes on from lots of sugar and no alcohol to no sugar and lots of alcohol, the density decreases. Um, so, turning it round to the side, the relevant side. 1100. So that's settling at about 1102, if you can read that. Um, which is, it hasn't really started going properly yet in terms of fermentation. And that's pretty uh, sugary. And the temperature is still only 18, so it's coming up, but not really enough to really take off yet. So that's why we haven't seen it firing ahead, but that has started, so it probably was even a bit higher than that at the beginning. Uh, I didn't measure it a couple of days ago, so. Potential alcohol, 14 and a half, roughly. Which is pretty much where you want it. It might have been 15 to start with. So I'm just going to have a little taste. It is good, that really. It is one of the best barrels of Grenache so far. And good colour as well. I'm just wondering how much the 15 people foot stopping has really helped extract more colour out of this. A couple of the other barrels over there, which have started fermenting, are not, not as. Um, which is this. Having said that, they didn't have the cold maceration, so that might explain it too. Um, but yeah, they, they, this really should, I've said this before, but it should stop really going now. Um, we may, what we may do is put a, a cooling, a warming plate in. So this plate here, we will, um, if we don't think it's going quick enough, we'll lower that in and we'll pump warm water through that, which will just warm the temperature of the barrel up to 26, 27, something like that, get the yeast activity going, and um, off it will go. That's all for now.